The trigger free jealousy. Yes. The trigger free jealousy, especially if that man fucked up. Y'all know where I come from, nigga. What's going on YouTube? It's Tyler. Came out totally again with a new video. Today I have a bunch of new pickups. Unfortunately, these, are, these aren't mine. These are my dad's. Um, but I definitely wanted to show you guys them, so let's jump right into it. The first one I'm going to show you guys is a Nike Kobe 8, size 11. The retail on these were 140. They are the gray and bolt colorway right here. You got the gray upper with that camouflage look. You have your Volt Nike swoosh right there. On the back, you have your Kobe, Kobe logo right there. And then your outsole is that Volt as well. Pretty simple shoe, nothing really to it. I believe these were a House of Hoops exclusive and Nike.com got them, of course. But these are the Nike Kobe 8 Volt right here. Moving right along, we have a Nike Sportswear box. These are the Nike Lunar Flight and Chukka, size 10 and a half. The retail on these were 170. Simple colorway, nothing really to it, nothing flashy, just a white, red, black colorway. You guys can see the red upper, that's your fly knit, of course, and then connecting on your eyelids is the fly wire right there. You have black laces that leads up to the Nike fly knit chuck of tongue. You have a black pull tab on the back, and your white lunar lawn midsole, and then there's your chuck of outsole right there. Very, very lightweight and very comfortable. If you guys are looking for that, of course, for a good summer shoe, definitely look into the chukkas. So there you have it right there. Right here I have a Saucony. I've never really owned a Saucony, or my dad's never owned a Saucony, so these are the first pair. I've seen them first. They are the Saucony Times Soulbox Edition collaboration, that, that is. Um, a lot of different uh, materials on the shoe, so I'm not going to look like an idiot. And, talk about the materials or anything but uh, you have your pink upper with a little bit of the gray new buck right there and on your back you have sock me written in um, pink I'm gonna show this shit you have sock me right there there's the shoe gum outsole I really like that that's a good touch to the shoe and then show sure you guys the inside that's the only um, thing that really shows that these are sole box times Saucony. You guys can take a look. So that's the shoe. Saucony times sole box. Moving right along. I'm going to save these bad boys for last. And then these are my my dad's latest pickup. They are the Nike Kobe 8. You're the snakes right here. Can't go wrong with the white and red and black shoe. You have your 3M Nike swoosh in gray with a little hit of a um, red splatter. I'm going to show you guys these up close as well. You guys can see that it has that red splattered on the tongue. And then you have your Kobe logo on the back. And then more of that Nike swoosh with the red splatter right there. You have a black midsole with your red, red splattered print right there as well. And then your red outsole. Really, really bright red outsole, which I really do like. It really brings out the shoe more. And then you have your Kobe logo right there up on top. So there you have it, the Nike Kobe 8, You're the Snakes. And last but not least, we have another Kobe 8. These are absolutely bananas. I'm going to show you guys the box, actually. Here you go, size 11. These are the um, sportswear pack. So, you guys probably already know the whole packaging of the shoe. These are absolutely crazy. Um, one of the best all-star shoes out of the pack, in my opinion. I wasn't really feeling the KDs, nor the LeBrons. These were the best out of all of them. It kind of reminds me of like a uh, cheese cheese pizza or something like that. You have your kind of like a light green Nike swoosh, white midsole, and on the white midsole, if you guys can see, it's kind of got like a, I don't, I can't really, you know, Fucking per se what? Braille? Braille. Braille shit. I, I guess it's Braille. But um and then we have a that Kobe logo on the back as well. Your insole is that Galaxy or Area 72 that is imprinted right there. And then your orange bottom 
absolutely crazy. Dope shoe, can't go wrong with the Kobe's. Very comfortable. Now I'm gonna show you guys what all these shoes look like on feet, um, cause my me and my dad wear the same shoe shoe size. So here we go. Through the highs and lows, trials and tribulations, you know how it go. How it I pray go. you niggas maintain. maintain. I pray you niggas maintain. maintain. Yeah, cause when shit get all bad and you watch the game change, fuck the bullshit. It's time to maintain. You gotta maintain. Gladly do the snap. Nappy and the razor where itch in case a nigga try to clap me. On that I ain't the killer, but for Skrilla, it gets nasty. Pop up on the raw night, get popped like mad acne. Uh. Uh. It ain't no coming home for you, homie. It's funny, uh -huh. fucking with these rhymes over time will turn you phony. I see niggas making money, becoming dealers. Dealer pair the squillers, then give the beats out and silly dealer. It gets more real up for real. Niggas that take your life, you won't even get life for the steel. And if you grill, the grill gets for me. Blow out your funds and leave it as a warning. For informers, I feel like a doorman. Ain't kidding, can't take the heat, get out the kitchen. It's things for soft guys like you, like knitting mittens, kissing kittens, stitching snitches, whispering. This is daddy, wish you had my bitches and my riches. Pump, niggas. Play my position with persistence, consistent with the flow. Nigga, we twisting up the drugs. I can't pump. In this life of sin, through the highs and lows, trials and tribulations, you know how it go. I pray you niggas maintain. I pray you niggas maintain. Maintain. Yeah. Cause when shit get all bad and you watch the game change Fuck the bullshit, it's time to maintain You gotta maintain Pass the hug, pass the hug, pass the hug